Hey everyone and welcome to this quick video overview of today's post. In this post we're looking at 7 plugins that can help make managing users on WordPress multi-site easier. Now if you didn't already know, it's important to keep in mind that when it comes to multi-site, by default users are set up as members of the network, but they're not set up as members of single sites. This means you're going to have to use plugins to give your users access to sites or to assign them different roles. That's the basic idea of these user plugins anyway, overcoming some of the default functionalities that come with multi-site. So let's get to the plugins themselves. First up, we have User Role Editor. User Role Editor is a plugin that allows you to edit, create, and fill selected user roles with the capabilities you require. The standard version also comes with multi-site support. However, the pro version of this plugin takes multi-site functionality up a notch, allowing you to manage roles and users for all of your sites from one point. You can also restrict the access of single site administrators to selected user capabilities, and you can also add or delete role operations. Finally, this plugin can also help you set up individual lists of themes available for activation to selected single site administrators. Number two on the list is Create User with Password Multisite, brought to you by the team at Move. When it comes to single site WordPress, admins would normally expect to be able to set a password when registering a new user. Sadly, this is not the case for WordPress Multisite. The ability for site admins to set passwords is removed, as users could potentially register for multiple sites within the site network. This simple plugin extends the basic functionality of multi-site by adding the password field to the user registration screen. This then allows super admins to set the password for each user during the user registration process. Alright, so the third plugin on this list is Delete Me. This handy plugin allows users with specific WordPress roles to delete themselves from anywhere where shortcodes can be used. When one of your users avails themselves of the options, they'll need to confirm their action. When they do, the plugin will automatically erase their stored information. Although this isn't a multi-site specific plugin, network activation and single site activation are both supported. Users and their content will only be deleted from the site they delete themselves from, and other network sites will remain unaffected. By default, users registered to multiple sites on the network are only deleted from the current site and will remain registered to the other sites. However, if the setting delete from network is checked, users will be deleted from the entire network. All right, next we have WP Front User Role Editor. This is a plugin which allows you to easily manage WordPress user roles within your site or network. In a nutshell, you can create edit or delete user roles and manage role capabilities. Sadly, only the pro version of this plugin features multi-site support, but if you do decide to invest in the pro version, you'll be able to perform actions such as managing and editing user roles, syncing roles, creating new roles, as well as deleting and restoring roles in the network. You also have the option of enabling large network functionality. So this can be handy if you host a large number of sites and you're having trouble with a slow performing server or if you're experiencing other overload issues. Next we have Profile Press. Profile Press enables you to create front-end login forms, custom user registration forms and front-end password reset forms. This plugin does require you to install a multi-site extension. But once you've done so, multi-site integration allows users to create a new site in your network through a front-end registration form. With the extension active, edit your registration form and add the shortcodes for the site address and site title to it. Upon successful registration, an email will be sent to the registered users to activate their website. Okay, next up we have Advanced Access Manager. Advanced Access Manager is all you need to manage access to your website front end and back end for users and visitors. Advanced Access Manager is also fully compatible with WordPress multi-site and with the free multi-site extension you can quickly navigate between your sites or even sync access settings with the click of a button. Another handy feature is that the plugin also extends default WordPress behavior and can restrict access to sites where a user is not a member. 
because normally by default any user can access any site on your multi-site network. But this can easily be altered with the multi-site non-member restriction option. This will automatically restrict access to the site and redirect users based on a site's access denied redirect rule. Okay, finally, the last plugin on our list is user switching. Sometimes the only way to troubleshoot or to help fix an issue with a user's site is to literally use the site as them. This simple plugin allows an admin to impersonate any user on a site or network by clicking on a link in the edit user screen. Once you have fixed the problem, a link to switch back to the admin account is inserted in the footer of the public facing site. So there you have it. If you currently run a WordPress multi-site operation and you need plugins to help with user management, you can't go wrong with the 7 plugins on this list. Thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next video.